What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Okay, we're here at the Grover Casino with John Lewis Dickinson ahead of his big fight with Stephen Simmons at the arena in Newcastle on Saturday. John Lewis, looking well? Feeling well? Aye, having great, you know, I'm in the shape of my life and ready to go. So this is, well, you know, this, the, the, what was the last fight? It was redemption, wasn't it? And it was a matter of Kurt Courtney Fry. Uh -huh. You went in there most likely underestimated the challenge because coming up from light heavyweight I didn't expect the Courtney Fry that turned up but obviously after getting such a bad start of the fight and then just being edged in the end and it could have gone either way and the, the heart you showed just to get through after being stung in the early rounds that must you know, it's taken positives out of a negative I mean how do you feel going, going into this one now? 100% I mean obviously the last fight I went in there like you say, underestimated them, and I was weight trained, which was a big thing in, in the camp, you know. That's why we've, um, we've brought a nutritionist, Chris Clayton, he's yeah. been doing all our nutrition, and um, my weight's bang. I mean, you can see the shape of my body, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, in, I'm in great condition, you know. I'm not killing myself for now, and I'm only a couple of pounds over the weight, and I've never, I've never killed myself for it. I'm eating loads and training hard, but it's, it's eating the right stuff, and, and I feel strong at the weight and everything, you know. Um, this, that. Like I say, I feel great. The training's gone well. Obviously, we've been able to eat and, and drink is, is, a, is a nice thing, you know. Yeah. Where I felt weak last time. Um, so, everything's spot on. It's just about going out there on Saturday night and doing a job on them. I think if this fight had happened a year ago, 18 months ago, you would have been going in a clear favourite for the fight. Um, not just from a local point of view, just in terms of, you know, the British Aye. champion, Lonsdale belt outright and everything. There's maybe you're going in as a slight underdog this time just because obviously of the, of the recent fights Aye. how do you see the fight itself going uh, like I say I mean I'm, I'm confident in my ability and what I've watched of Simmons over the, over the years you know like with him being on the telly and stuff I think I'm going to be I think I'm going to be able to catch him pretty, pretty much when I want Yeah. so I, I think I'll be too clever for him and I think my boxing ability will be, uh, be a bit too much for him so that's that's the way I see it happening, you know. I've been, been able to catch him pretty much, pretty much when I want to. Um, he's a tough fighter though, and it's going to be a hard fight. But I'm confident. Like I say, my fitness is great. I'm, I've never been in this shape in my life, and ready to just go and do the business. Well, you when you've been boxing at your very best, it's been when you've been using your footwork, you've been changing the angles, moving all the time, not letting them get set. Whereas recently when you've actually had your problems it's because you've just been staying in the pocket too much that's it i exactly i mean over mckenzie biggest puncher out there oh. and i stood in front of him and let him use it as a punch bag you know that's another thing it was it wasn't mentally right and, yeah. and, and didn't carry out a game plan so the, the two losses although the two losses i know why where i went wrong and i can and i've i can sort that out you know yeah. and, and which we have sorted out so going into this fight i'm I'm fresh and I'm, I'm looking for it. And being an underdog, I love it. Yeah. Love going an underdog, you know what I mean? Means the punters can win some good money on us. Yeah. But you've also got the driving force as well because, you know, I think boxers, for as long as I've watched boxing, there's always been certain boxers that have been questioned, that have been doubted. And then they've proven the doubt as wrong. Yeah. And it's obviously you want to be another one of those in uh, terms of because it gives you that motivation. Of, of course. Listen, I came back from uh, uh, worse than this. I had it when I. Got me, I had my jaw broken, yeah. I got beat twice then, and then I went on to win a British title outright. I've done it before, I've, and I'm going to do it again, you know. I, it, it's all about the mental attitude and, and putting it right, doing it in the gym. The hard work's been done, I'm going to enjoy myself on Saturday night yeah. and win that belt, you know. I've done all the graft, I'm getting up every morning early and going on the hitting them roads for, and doing all them miles, yeah. going to the gym, slugging it out, all them, you know, hours and hours and hours upon hours, hundreds of hours of training yeah. and running. I'm going to enjoy myself for half an hour on Saturday night and I'm going to go and beat Simmons, you know. Half an hour? That's it. Interesting well, to say half an hour because both, both as, of you... That's as long, that's, as, that's the length of time it can go, you know what yeah, I mean? Obviously, yeah. that's it. 
But like I say, I'm going in there confident, and whatever happens, happens. As long as I get the win, I, I don't mind. I think obviously, in the build up to the fight, both guys, there's, there's obviously genuine respect there. And there has to be, really. Mm -hmm. But at the same point, both of you have said that you expect the fight to maybe be end early. Well, like I say, I, I, I think if I'm right, I think I'll be able to catch him pretty much easy, you know what I mean? And, and, he, and he looks that way. So if, if I am right and, and he's walking on the punches, it, it's not going to last that long, you know? But I'm, I'm ready for a, a 10 round war, yeah. which, which I always, like, I've prepared myself for. So whichever way it happens, it happens. As long as I get the win, I don't mind. Yeah, well. I've seen some photos on Facebook where, you, where Facebook even where you're looking really, really lean, looking aye. well. Yeah. I'll see you again at the the way in at the at the Hilton tomorrow, yeah. getting all the aye, all the photos the done. Like I see, I'm, when you feel good, it, it, it lifts your game that like, extra, you know. And, and I feel I feel spot on. My weight's bang on, and my body looks in tremendous shape. So it's just about carrying out the job now. Well, you're certainly one of the most popular, if not the most popular boxer from the northeast of England who's fighting right now, so there's going to be a load of support there for yeah, you. Yeah. John right. Lewis, all the very best of luck. Thanks I'll very see much. you then, Cheers. and I'll see you afterwards. You. Cheers, man. Cheers, John. Cheers, man. Cheers, always, always quality. Thanks. Best of luck.